From the streets of inner city Los Angeles to Rhodes Scholarship finalists tonight, our Brooke Rogers introduces us to Kaylin Moore, a name to remember. For 22-year-old Kylan Moore, playing college football was both a dream and an escape growing up in inner city Los Angeles. It is not abnormal to walk outside the house and see drug syringes on the ground, see crack pipes. We would look to the ground and see all these horrible things, but we would look to the skies and we would see our dreams. Now his dreams have surpassed football. Kylan, a senior at TCU, learned last week that he is a finalist for a coveted Rhodes Scholarship. And then like, I couldn't even talk. I literally just got up and I walked. I must have walked for like two miles. His first call was to his mother because he says the credit goes to her and God. Despite abuse and poverty, she committed herself to raising children who could choose their destiny. Because I never saw these blessings coming. And the, for my mom, that confirms to her that she was right. When she decided that, you know, even though we're in, a, in, this, in this area, in the hood, the hood will not live in us. Football led him to Marist College, and he transferred to TCU last year. Kylan wanted his father to see him play football on TV. He is in prison, serving a life sentence for murder. Pretty much I would not stop playing football until my father could see me play from the prison. He hopes he will soon tell his parents he is a Rhodes Scholar. But either way, he sees educational policy in his future and a run for office. I think I have a unique perspective. I think I have a unique story to tell. And I think I have unique things to offer to the world. Kylan's interview with the Rhodes Scholarship Committee is a week from tomorrow in Los Angeles. There has only been one Rhodes Scholar in the history of TCU, and that was in 1975. In Fort Worth, Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News. Got a lot of people rooting for him yes, now, right? Yes, absolutely. I mean, that is a coveted award, and oh, yeah. we are rooting for you, that's for sure.